Hey everybody, how's life treating you? I'm Russ Robo and welcome back to Ratchet and Clank Going Commando. I wanted to actually start off in the ship before heading to the Thug Rendezvous, uh, rendezvous point in the Feltson system because I'm pretty sure there's either a space battle or a cutscene that it's going to start. So without further delay, let's get right into it. Defeat the Thug ships. Okay, I thought so. So yeah, space battle time. Hmm. I was just thinking about the ship battles. I'm pretty sure it's not this game. It's got to be at least it's got to be up your arsenal or at least deadlock. But later on you can upgrade the ship. Let's hope these weapons work. All right, here we go. Uh, destroy thugs for left ships in the rendezvous sector and disrupt their rendezvous. Ship controls fires guns, secondary weapons activates turbo, barrel roll, ship straighten ship. Okay, we're good. What was that? Oh, neat. How do I get the... How do I get the tutorial? Okay. I was like, how do I get that to turn off? Alright, they're all behind me. Ooh! Oh, no! Oh, boy. Got him. Got you now. Okay, so I don't have to be aimed right at him. I just need to follow along well enough. I think we're doing great. Whoa, 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 watch it. I want to do some evasive maneuvers when they're firing right at my butt. Shit. Hey, there we go. I can get raritanium, but really, I wish there was HP more so. There we go. Oh, we're hurting. Enemy ships remaining nine? Oh god, we might have to redo this. Enemy ships. Wave one. Oh no, god, these are multiple waves. I'm trying not to let him get a hold on me. One ship? Come on, tell me it's one ship. No, he's got me. Evasive maneuver. Oh my god, this one dude. There he is. Yes! God, that's only the first wave though. Please, give me more HP. I've got shields back, but oh god. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god, are you kidding me? Hang on, I think there's something I can do through here. Was this a platinum bolt? I can't remember. I know I've been through here before. Just nice and easy like. Raritanium, I don't need raritanium. I think this is it, folks. It's been fun. 23 enemy ships. Yeah, there's like, there was like no way. Destroy all. Okay, well, I'll probably just skip to when I actually defeat them then. Tell me I passed it. Yes, thank God. Got mad skills. <laughs> mad skill. Uh, yeah, a difficult challenge, but one that a trained commando. Hold on, I'm intercepting a transmission. For the fifth time, I have a collect call to thugs for less from a Mister. You are gonna die. Will you accept the charges? Oh, uh, you are go 
on the dime. I'll take that as a yes. Thank you. You idiot. <laughs> Uh-oh. I'm paying top dollar for your protection, and your moron employees are off at some picnic. Hey, that was a bonding exercise. They're not! I'm at the bigger point now. If your men aren't here pronto, you can kiss this contract goodbye. Uh, oh, yeah? Well, you can kiss your, uh, uh, your, your, uh, you know what I mean. Uh, dang it. <laughs> Did you trace that? Coordinates locked in. We are headed there now. Nice. You may choose a new challenge to acquire more bolts or exit to the galactic map. Downloaded coordinates for Canal City. Planet Notak. Uh, Definitely galactic map time. Boop. Thank you. <laughs> Got him. Yeah, I could do more bolts, but eh. So, how's the reception out here? We have sports, weather, ooh, the science channel. <laughs> Keep going. Whoa, what's that? The man, the myth, the legend, the loser. Captain Quark, once the idol of everyone in the galaxy, has finally hit rock bottom. After his humiliation at the hands of Ratchet and Clank, Quark sold bogus merchandise he claimed were Gadgetron products. But a key defect in this product, the personal hygienator, caused severe irritation in sensitive body areas and alerted authorities to Quark's scam. Behind the Hero will return after these messages. That was Spike Spiegel well, from Cowboy Bebop. A lot. Yes. I suppose it... All this time, my personal hygienator must have been causing that itch. Anyway, we should be at our destination shortly. I mean, I'm pretty sure that was him. Like, or, his, you know, his voice actor. I'm pretty good with voices. Too late again. We always seem to be a bit late. Why is that? <laughs> Fourth wall! Well, let's check this place out and find out where he's headed. What's crazy is it like, oh, this is a big planet. Oh, gosh. This is going to be a longer episode. I hope you guys are ready. I'll, of course, cut out most of that ship battling except for the first and last bits. But, yeah, it's going to take a while. I can't quite recall, but this is a big planet, I think. And it is time to get into it. Let's see if we can buy any new... That's probably why they gave me the option to, um... Oh, I bought a new game... Uh, uh, I bought a new weapon called the Secret Gun. I haven't tried it out yet. But anyway, that's probably why they gave me the option to do uh, more battles for bolts, because there are new weapons to buy. I remember these. Synthenoid. They were... Oh, God, I thought they weren't until uh, up your arsenal. Okay, let's try that Seeker Gun then. Weapons... Seeker gun. Okay, I remember it now. Let's see. That's kind of like... Oh. Uh, might be a bit of a waste. Uh-oh. God dang, are you kidding me? I just didn't want to use ammo. But yeah, we've got new weapons we can unlock, so that's awesome. I, I kind of sort of remember this planet maybe a little bit. Oh god, I, I've been able to, up until this point, resist the temptation to break lampposts and all the breakables in the game. For some reason, now I'm tempted. I just can't help it. You know what we want. I know the Seeker is a brand new weapon, but you see it's kind of basic. It just basically, it finds him and, and it fires, and like, oh, watch it. Bring him over. There you go. I knew it. Yeah, it just finds him, and it it's kind of like a torpedo. It's kind of like a torpedo, but in the air. Freaking love this planet. I love all the planets, really. Woo! There they go.
You missed me. Oh, what? Oh, God, I didn't even see it. I was too busy watching the turret. I'm an idiot. Oh, what? I didn't realize there was one left. Oh, come on out here and meet my turret. Come on. Meet my turret. There you go. Good man. Okay. God, you can break those too. Come on. You can't give me so many breakables. Must resist urge. All right, no more, no more, because I'm gonna have to cut too much out of the episode. Wait, what? Can't tell what's enemies and what ain't. I'm just over here smacking everything. I think that's uh, that thing's making more of them, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, never mind. My turret took care of it. Hey, really? He's behind a bush. Excellent, excellent. Okay, I think we got them all. Going a little low on the HP. You can't buy it like you can ammo. I need to be careful. Here, have one of these as a parting gift. Oh boy. That's funny. <laughs> Ooh! Yes! I needed that. <laughs> I needed that. Whoa, what the? Whoa! That thing looks a little tough. Okay. How about the Seeker Gun? Or the Tesla Coil? Okay, want to make sure to strafe. Ooh! That is not effective enough. I got lucky on that one. I don't have a destructive impulse. You have a destructive impulse. Woo! Whoa! Ah, oh, blasted. That's okay, there's nanotech right over here. Lucky shot. God, you can break these two, you can break everything! I can't break everything though, I don't have that kind of time. But man, if I did! Here you go! One for each of you. I'm gonna save up for those uh, droids next. I really like the look of them. Knew it! Oh yeah. Funny story though, I was thinking this might be the uh, path to the next area. So now I'm kind of wondering where that's at exactly. Oh, there it is. Wait, I see another billboard. Ah, some nice ammo. Not too bad. I like the wind chime sound. If you're hearing that, it sounds like wind chimes. It's super awesome. Ooh, that one might be a little bit too far. Oh god, I didn't realize there was a ship over there. Woo! Can it reach? That is the question. Seeker gun. Pardon me. Gotta give it 
some uh, use. Oh yeah. Okay, so that's the uh, that's the benefit to it is that it doesn't have a lot of shots, but it's really powerful. So you don't want to use it against guys like them, or uh, you want you want to use it against the big the big enemies. This is good for little enemies. Beautiful. Nice. Oh, I didn't even see all this over here. Must destroy. Got him. See, that's why I like the jetpack. There's almost no latency between the jumps. And you can see the difference when I switch to the helipack. See how he has to sort of glide down for a second? Oh, okay, never mind. I guess they changed that. You can do it almost instantly. Yeah, he sort of hops. Okay, so it's about the same. Still prefer the jetpack, though. Pardon me. Continue point. <gasps> Maximum nanotech. You have found a nanotech boost. Yes. Nanotech boosts instantly increase your maximum nanotech capacity. I don't know if I'll leave it in the video, but during my uh, during my space battle, I found another nanotech booster as well. But it was inside of a ship that you have to navigate through, and if you hit the walls, you'll blow up. I unfortunately hit the walls, so I didn't get to keep that nanotech booster. I don't believe. So all of that was just for the nanotech booster, which is still pretty cool, though. Let's go, Chopper. Did we get them all? Is there another dispenser making more? Beautiful. Beautiful. So many wonderful bolts to be had in this game. I think enemies just popped up. Yeah, they did. Oop. Oh, they can hit each other? That's interesting. This probably isn't the best weapon to be using against those guys, but I just wanted to give it some experience. Oh, no, 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 no. Let me back up. Oh, big fish coming. Yep. Oh. Well, that's embarrassing. It's okay, let's upgrade this bad boy. Whoop! Yeah, he tried. Hey, <laughs> I got him. I see nanotech. The chopper. Oh, I could have gone through here. I should have gotten up through there. Ah, uh, it might have saved me. I don't know if I would have made it in time, but it could have worked. Okay, nothing through here. Here I am craning my neck. Ow. To try to see if there's... Okay, so that's probably the path through once you go through the actual traditional way. That's probably the path back. So this guy over here. What about, what about over here? Anything over here? In the morning, uh, as you're watching this, it's... Uh, actually, I don't know when this is going to come out, but... Currently, it's like 5 a.m. Tuesday, so I'm planning on doing a live stream in the morning in a few hours. I'm going to make it Earth Defense Force. I think that one will come over really nicely. Haven't done that one in a while. Oh, God, I can't help it. There's two... Ah! Gotta stop. Remind me when I get 20,000 to buy that new weapon. I think it was 20,000. Here they come. Oh, no. Ah, I need the thermo -gelizer. The gelatinator. <laughs> uh, 
that would be this guy. Terminator. Make it ice, baby. I don't think there's anything under it, do you? Nah. It's just gonna keep blasting those little robots until, okay. I was gonna say, until one of the turrets accidentally hits the dispenser. But if you could, like, not hit the dispenser, I don't know how many bolts you could get from that, but I imagine it's a lot. Woo! Nope. Not today. Let's see. What would be the most fun to do on this one? up coming as well. I don't know about that one. We need the seeker for that guy. Woo! Okay, hang on there. Let's see now. Oh, you know what I didn't buy instead of the turret gun, uh, there was an option for a sniper rifle as well. Hang on, I got an idea. What if we distracted him with one of these guys? Bang! Bang! And he's still attacking the... Yeah, he's still attacking the dummy! Yes! Good job, dummy. Trick me. Coming out there from behind the barrels, I see. I'm sorry, I just like to watch him explode. <laughs> it's not even worth any bolts. I knew it! I ain't falling for that again. Yes! Woo! You gotta admit, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Let's see, I don't think there's anything up there. too close to the barrels. Ha! Huh. Can't believe I made it through all that unscathed. It's weird. Sometimes I can get through wave after wave of enemies without getting touched. And then other times, little minions will freaking get me. And I don't know... <laughs> I just don't know what to do about that. There's very little consistency. Oh god. Okay, I really thought that was going to explode me. Whee! But yeah, there's there's somewhat a lack of consistency with my skill level. Let's put it that way. Does that door open? Do I I feel like I need to get through there? Come on, Ratchet, you were aimed right at it. There you go. How did that not blow up the other one? Really? I thought for sure I had to go in there. Alright, well where's the next area? Interesting. Not through here, certainly. No? Ah, there it is. I see it now. Checkpoint. Up. Oh, yep, there it is. Whoa, what? I'm side strafing. Why didn't it? Oh. Woo! 
Okay, there we go. Now what can I throw over there? That'll do it. Beautiful. Anything back here? One box. Can I get to any kind of bolts or platinum bolts or... Oh, what's that? You see that down there? That's the thing. You remember the thing. Alright. Uh, that is this guy. You see it? Is that a secret path? Ah, that opens the door! Okay. The door I was just looking at. Oh, I, I probably gotta get in there real quick. It's not gonna stay open forever. It's still open. Oh, we might make it. I don't know if it's really on a time limit. There we go. Okay, so I just caught that out of the corner of my eye. Out of the corner of my own eyeballs. Oh, God. I'm stuck in here. Nope. Psych. So that's how you get through there. Lovely. And I took care of these guys already. Cutscene? I thought so. Got a ship that needs, uh, improvements? Worried about getting caught? At Slim Cognitos, your secret is safe with us. Whether it's weapons, shielding, or a new hyperspace module, we'll hook you up quickly, cheaply, and most important, quietly. So next time you're in the market for some, uh, legally ambiguous refashioning, remember the name. Slim Cognitos. The only inspections we pass are yours. I love it. Starship mods. Hmm. Well, a quick visit to Slim's wouldn't cost us much time. Or maybe we should check out that chemical factory. Someone inside might know where the thief was headed. Okay, so several things. Um, I do want to visit Slim Cognito's shack uh, to get upgrades because that will make uh, battling like much, much easier. As you could see, it was kind of difficult the last time. Oh, what? Lucky shot. But yeah, uh, so I was wrong. It's not its not just to up your arsenal that allows you to um, upgrade your ship. It's apparently going commando as well, which is excellent. That's pretty freaking awesome. I think the system is more refined in up your arsenal. Like, you have an entire... Uh, like, it's weird. I think you're you're on like a starship, and your ship is inside of the ship. So you have like a cruiser. Yeah, your your starship is inside of a cruiser. And while you're in the cruiser, you can upgrade your ship from there, and it's much more detailed. And also, this is okay. I have to go through the path to get back. But yeah, it's really cool. Now I'm not sure how in depth. It is in uh, going commando with the uh, ship upgrades, but we'll see. Oh look, this is interesting. If you stand right here, then your turrets can get lots and lots of experience, and they won't accidentally hit the dispenser. Although I will say, it looks like the dispenser either has a limit to how much it can dispense, or one of my turrets accidentally hit it. I'm not sure. It didn't look like a turret hit it. But I don't know, maybe they maybe they saw what people were doing with that and made it so that the... Because, I mean, on Ratchet & Clank regular, the enemies would get down to the point where they would only drop one bolt per kill. But if you never destroyed the dispensers, that's basically still infinite bolts as long as you're willing to wait there long enough. That one always gets me. Dang it. Anyway, yeah, as long as you're willing to wait long enough. Infinite bolts. Can't get me now. What? Where'd he go? Why didn't you? Ah! My turret didn't attack him. Almost got got again for no reason. Up. Oh, time for the thermo thing. Oh boy. Pardon me. Got gotta do the thing. We use the Terminator. Oh crap! Don't get in the water. Don't get in the water. It's a Terminator puzzle. Don't you just love it? Oh god, I need that nanotech so bad. 
<laughs> I love how like in Ratchet and Clank for the ma for like for most of the game I had like four nanotech and then I actually got six and then eight and it's like this game I have like so much more nanotech and like even if only three or four of them are missing I'm like I need nanotech. Uh, that's this game conditions you to be like, oh my god, I'm about to die when you're only missing like three health. And you've got like 20, 30 bars left. There we go. Into the water. Anything down here? No? Okay, great. Easy peasy. Lemonade squeezy. Let's see, what's next? Okay, so... I was about to say, don't you dare get hit. The pattern is obviously, like, ice, no ice, ice, no ice. That sort of business. Okay, I'm sensing wall jump? Maybe not. Oh, okay, can't do that. Um, ah, gotta, gotta turn the bolt crank. I was playing Mario Party the other night, and if anybody knows how to frickin' fix the issue with, uh, uh oh, how do I get, uh oh, okay. If anybody knows how to fix the issue with the, um, the Enrage 64 controller option, it's like, it's the, it's the one that's supposed to allow you to use an analog controller to play Mario Party on an emulator, but I can't get it to work, so I'm stuck on keyboard. And when you're stuck on a keyboard, there's no analog stick that you can spin for some of the mini games. So I'm over there getting beat by computers on easy because I can't spin the stick. Because I can't get the controller to work. Uh, Aurora, if she's watching this, she got it to freaking work, but I can't figure it out. And now I, I don't know which controller we set up, and I think I accidentally cleared the settings. So now I don't even have that. I might have to look that up. Because I actually want to play Mario Party using the controller. I don't know if it matters what type of controller you use. I was trying to use a PC controller that emulates an Xbox controller. Um, and then of course I have this one that I use for my PS2, PS1 and PS2 games, which is the traditional triangle, square, circle, and X. I've always been uh, loyal to PlayStation, but I acknowledge the excellence of the other consoles. Like you can't just be like, oh, this one's the greatest. They've all got amazing games on them. They really do. Okay, I uh, can't break those. Save point. Oh, so I want to wait until that gets to the top, right? Yeah. I'm gonna have to anticipate when it's about to get to the top, though, because if I start it too early, oh, freeze now, freeze now, freeze now, perfect. And of course, that fish is still down there too. There we go. Yeah, if I started it too early, the water level would be too low by the time it finished freezing. Since it takes a minute, you have to anticipate... Mm. Pardon me, I have a, uh, had a burp. You have to anticipate the amount of time it takes in order to get the water level to where you want it. Which is another example here. Because I need to get through that pipe. Oh, don't let it cover. Yes! Nailed it. First try. Nothing in there, obviously, except a fish. Uh-oh, I want it to be just a little bit higher. Uh, or do I? Can I make it? I'm worried that fish is going to get me if I unfreeze the water. Hang on, I think I can make that. Come on. Oh, yes! Got it. Thought I might have to freeze and then unfreeze the water really quickly. Ooh, I'm, I, I actually didn't think I needed those save points, but now I'm actually really thankful for them. So now I need to unfreeze the water and then freeze it back again, I think, so that I can make it to that second portion. Yeah, I need to let it ice over uh, completely right about now. Beautiful. Beautiful. See, I are good at puzzles. Barbara are good at puzzles. Okay, so it's another, probably a fish in there. Yep, I see him. Probably on the way down, eh? There we go. There's enough room. 
As long as there's enough room to get through the pipe, I think we're fine. Man, they got fish on both sides. Yeah, you don't want to let it freeze too low, because then you can't make... Crap. Then you can't make that. Oh, no. You got to be kidding me. Come on. Oh, no. I got to do this whole thing again? Come on. Maybe if I unfreeze it really quick, you can't get to me. Raise up, raise up. Oh, no, it's going lower. Don't see me. Don't move. Its vision is based on movement. Oh, run away. No. Okay, so you do have to Perhaps do that. these robots can assist us. Excuse me? Have you seen any masked weirdos? I think I had better do the talking. A masked customer picked up an order not long ago. Recently, they received a new transmission from him, and they are willing to show it to us for a small price. 6,000 volts. Yes, I need to order two more containers of sulfuric acid. Oops. Uh, better make that five containers and uh, four containers of liquid hydrogen. Oops. Uh, better add six crates of nitroglycerin and. Just give me double that. And I need it delivered. <laughs> hey, what? What? <laughs> oh, oh, nothing. <laughs> just some robot humor. Okay, funny guy. Let's just head to those coordinates. Nice. Yeah, I um downloaded coordinates. Okay, excellent. What was it? Um, I'm glad I can still kind of chuckle a little bit at those scenes even though like gosh it's been so long but it's nice to know that it still means so much to me it's still funny a little bit <laughs> or at least I wouldn't say funny it puts a smile on my face you know nostalgia you know it's really nice I think that's this planet completed uh, I don't know if we have enough to buy a new weapon let's check because I just paid the what was it, a thousand or ten thousand for that info bot? Ah, uh, ooh, that's gonna cost a. That's gonna take a bit. Mm. Why don't we go to Slim Cognitos before we exit out? See what we can put on our ship. Ba bam! Yeah, this planet. That it was a nice one. I really enjoyed this planet. Got knocked out once or twice, I think, but uh, it worked. Slim Cognitos Ship Shack. Yes. Hey, that is the one I was thinking of. Yeah. Now, I don't know whether he requires bolts or raritanium to upgrade the ship. I'm betting it's raritanium. But we shall see. I believe I got some raritanium in some of those ship battles that we went through, so that's also going to be pretty good. I bet you it's raritanium. Yep, yep. Yeah, this is the smaller one, and then in the... It's either deadlocked or up your arsenal, it's a whole aircraft carrier, like a, a ship carrier, you know, you're on a frigate in space, and your ship is on there, and you can do the upgrades through there. Uh, yes, Maritanium, okay, let's take a look at all of them. Um, triple boost, I don't use boost very much. Fusion laser cannons, electro mine launcher, fast lock missile launcher, torpedo launcher, at advanced shielding system, I'm gonna need that. Nuclear detonation device, hyperspace warp system, high lift wings, and heavy ordnance wings. Uh, I've only got 30 rar raritanium though, so I'm going to want more shields if I can afford it. Advanced shielding system, 30. Yep. That's about it. I've got 10 left. What else can I get? High lift wings or the heavy ordnance wings? I can't remember the difference. I'm going to go with high lift. And then I can get heavy ordnance. I can buy it all. Let's see, I've only got five left, so I don't think, yeah, I'll save it. Actually, it has a standard wings, heavy ordnance wings. Okay, it had a, it had a uh, description at the top of the screen. I was wondering whether or not it would uh, give me a description as to whether or not that gives the shield the ship more 
health or does it make it tougher or what does it do, you know, but it doesn't tell me. Just for looks, I suppose. But at least we have a more advanced shielding system now. But anyway, uh, I believe that's all the time I have left for this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, let me know in the comment section below. Likes are always appreciated. And until next time, take it easy, my friends. Oh,